Hey Dave, so talk to me about being the resident historian slash tour guide here. Uh, I started working here in 2001, so I have a pretty good knowledge of where things happen during the making of the movie. Uh, I've watched it a bunch of times. So just uh, going out on the golf course, I've, I've figured out where pretty much everything happened. Uh, today, I showed you guys around. I showed you that what's now our 10th tee was used as the first tee back in the day when they did filming of the movie. Uh, showed you where the habit camps were, where Rodney said this and did that. Um, just working here for a while, I've learned all the spots where things happen. So that makes me the historian, I guess. How how cool is it to have that nostalgia here? Uh, it's great. I mean, if you look with, at what's behind me, almost all of our memorabilia has, uh, or our, our merchandise rather, has the gopher on it, which of course was the big thing in the movie, the gopher. Um, people come here just because of the filming of Caddyshack, you know, or a private club, but you know, it's, if you stay at certain hotels, you can come here and play. Um, so they come here, I've had people come wearing Rodney Dangerfield's pants and bringing a DVD player and playing the movie while they play and they, you know, ask me, you know, hey, where did this happen, where did that happen, and I'll tell them. Uh, actually, I had a couple come here that the guy isn't even a golfer, but he loved the movie, so the wife brought him here and I took him on a tour and I showed him where things happened during the making of the movie, just like I did with you guys today.